everybody, Jimmy Productions here, and today I'm going to review Open Emu. So basically today, um, currently is the 19th, yes, the same day I got banned from Truckers MP, uh, a little note on that later. You know, uh, Open Emu is like an emulator, but it's for Mac, and there's a lot of games that you can play from the Sony PlayStation which late which uh, you need a disc based game games for this but I I'll cover that later and all and of course Sony PSP um virtual boy Nintendo DS 64 Nintendo in general the Neo Geo uh and uh, Atari, um, Game Boy, stuff like this, um, and I think it's really cool and all, and today we're just, I'm gonna show you what you can do with it, so, first of all, um, how you're gonna wanna download this is go to, just type up openemu.org, Click on download, and then, and then, uh, it should be done. But, let's just say you get an error message pops up and all. What you're going to want to do is, uh, hold up. I may have to bleep this out in the editing, I'm not sure. Uh, where's settings? <laughs> there you go. You're probably going to want to go to, um, huh, I'm just trying to look for it. Okay, I found it. It's in security and privacy. So what you're going to now want to do is just go to, um, just here and all, and I'm just trying to remember. Uh, camera, nope, nope, and there we go, input monitoring, you're going to want to check that off by clicking the lock and all, and then once you check off that, just, you also click on open emu, yep, and there, so then you have open emu on your computer. Uh, we're gonna have to do that. I did not realize it would reset. Oh well. Um, now what you're gonna want to do go to input monitoring. Uh, hopefully it doesn't say. Okay, good. Unlock and do that. Well, actually, yes. Yes. Um. And there. So we're gonna lock that. And done. So now. Hmm. That's strange. Uh. Can't. There we go. General. Do now. Open anyway. Open. And there. Um. I'll probably cut a bit of the stuff out. But that's basically how you do it. Now you have this. So. Let's go to. Oh yeah. Other things that. Let's just say you want to download a game. <laughs> go to... What is it again? Uh... Custom ROMs... Cu hold up. Uh... Custom dash... Well, uh... Little... Thing. Sideways thing. ROMs.com slash ROMs. Okay, so there we go. Let's just say you want... Uh... Um, Need 
for speed. Wait, hold up. PlayStation 2. Huh, I didn't realize that there's a PlayStation 2 emulator. Um, I I'll check that out later. So basically, let. by the way, you do want to go to Open Emu and check what games are available. Because I try to download an Xbox game, you need a certain other thing that's not installed on Open Emu. So let's just do Sony PSP. Want to find it? There we go. And now we'll just tur search up. Uh, let's just do. Uh, I don't know. Need for speed. Underground rivals. Or, by the way, you don't want file not found. That is not good. Just keep up looking up for need for speed. Or whatever game you want. Undercover. There we go. Make sure you don't have the game. I have shift. Download ROM. And it will download. So once that is download. What you're going to want to do. Is. Uh, wait. Oh wait a minute. It's just uploading right now. That should be done. And done. Wait. It's okay if it decompresses the zip file. And now it's done. So, you're gonna now wanna do. If you know the actual game's console, you can drag it into there. But let's just say you don't. You wanna go to all games. I have pull position, need for speed, Gran Turismo. And just wanna throw that in. And now it should have game scanner. Game one of one. And it'll be loading. Done. So now, uh, you now have Need for Speed or whatever game you want. As for example, I have Undercover. Just gonna quit everything out, and I'll see y'all when I'm playing Gran Turismo. Oh, well. So um, this is really what you will see when you open up the game. Oh, uh, you may get the M, the, the, uh, what do you call it? You know, the little startup key. Um, it can be anything. But, good thing's that you can use your PlayStation controller with this. There we go. And there we go. It is now up. Uh, you can also do, uh, full screen. And there. And,. My rating on at least Gran Turismo PSP, um, I would say 8 because, uh, basically I would say 8 because sometimes it lags out and it may crash or something like that. But I would recommend, if it gets, like, really slow and glitchy, just restart the game. Like, leave the game and then join back in. It'll then fix everything. As you can see, you have all your cars. You can drive them and all. Um, amazing. Uh, Gran Turismo Theater. Uh, you, you even have your intro movie. It just lagged a bit there, but... That's, oh, normal, basically. So, this is your intro movie. Uh, that works. The GT logo works. Um, you know, you can have your replays. Let's go back. I think even multiplayer may work. With a bit of, uh, mods, you can get multiplayer to work. I'm still trying to test out, uh... Multiplayer on this game, but other than that, I would say this game or just really open emu in general is amazing, and it is not just available on a, a Mac, but also on Windows. And on Windows, it will have probably more consoles because Windows is a lot more open and free. So thank you all for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe and share for more great content like this. And uh, see you all later. Goodbye. Peace.